Do you think anyone can save himself or herself from hell? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, guys and gals, and of course, boys and girls, what's going on everyone? I'm both and welcome back. So I had this question in my last video and someone asked me, uh, do you think anyone can save himself from hell? And this is a question that a lot of uh, unbelievers ask to questions and, and I'm going to um, uh, talk about this question and, and uh, give the answer to this question in this video. But before we get into it, if this is your first time uh, watching this video or coming across the channel, please consider subscribing and liking and sharing and and uh, tur um, turn on those uh, notifications as, as it really helps me out. Share with your friends and families. And also, the giveaway contest is still in the works. Once we reach um, 300 subscribers, um, um, whoever wins uh, uh, the giveaway contest will will earn a um, a, a free $15 PSN gift card for the store and also a shout out of any social media platform or the choice. And the rest of the information is down in the uh, disc description down below. But without further ado guys, let's get into the uh, video. So do you think anyone can save himself or herself from hell? And the answer to that question is no because once you, because once you're in hell, there's no once you're in hell, you're um, you're, you're just completely uh, cut off from God. There's no hope of salvation, no hope of, of rest, no hope of love, none of that. In 2 Thessalonians chapter 1, verse 8-9, through 9, He will punish those who do not know God or do not obey the gospel of our Lord Jesus. They will be punished with everlasting destruction and shut out from the presence of the Lord and from the majesty of His power. So, go, so going back to what I said, um, once you're in hell, um, you're just completely separated and, and cut off from God. You can't, um, you can't talk to Him. You can't, um, you can't experience the the goodness of Him. You can't experience any love. Pretty much everything that that is in the name of the Lord, you can't, you can't um, um, have in hell because in hell there's just completely a lot of destruction, a lot of um, fear, a lot of burning, a lot of punishment and torture, and a lot of weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth. dead and in hell that's it there there are just no more chances of repentance and 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 no hope of salvation however there is another side to this question and in life you can't no one can say no one can save themselves from hell but only through jesus you are saved and that is and that is by accepting uh jesus christ as as your lord and savior and believing that 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 he took your sins all of your sins and and put it on himself on the cross and die for your sins and and did it to save you in Ephesians chapter 2 verse 8 through 9 for it is by grace you have been saved through faith and this not from yourselves it is a gift from of God not by not by works so that no one can boast so this means that 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 it is that it is only by grace that that we are saved through faith and and grace is, is something that that we can't earn nor nor deserves I, I mean I mean in God's eyes we are all broken people and and bad sinners you, you, you know who uh do do all these bad things and 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 so and so and so grace is 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 something is, is something that that we don't deserve but god still gives us freely because because he loves us and and in hopes that that we um love him for that and 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 appreciate his grace because 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 again grace is is, is something that that us as bad people bad people and sinners don't deserve but he gives grace freely to us because because he loves us very much but another huge factor um w uh, when it comes to the salvation is repentance and although we're not saved by doing good things or good deeds even though um uh we do things that are righteous that are righteous in christ um that that's a definite sign that that you're repenting and trying to repent so for example if i um if i if i uh, drink um a um uh six packs well, 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 one pack of, of six beers a day, every day, but 
but if I stop that and um, and and uh, I start you know reading the Bible and whatnot or um, or or trying to uh, you know you know follow God or follow Christ, that's a that's a sign of repentance that 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 that, that I'm trying to do better. Repentance is well 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 our actions is is reflects on. On repentance and and also the uh, and also the uh, renewal of the heart and mind. And last but not least, uh, another big uh, key factor to salvation is is uh, believing in Jesus Christ and accepting accepting Him as as your Lord and Savior. In John chapter three verse sixteen, it says that for God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have eternal life. So th so this means that so th this means that. That that uh by by believing in God and well believing um uh uh in, in Jesus Christ um and and believing that that He died to save you that that He took all your sins and and, and paid for it all and was risen on the third day on, on the third day um after His death that that He defeated death and 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 and, ro and rose from the dead by by believing that. That is also a, a a big key factor to uh, to uh, being saved by by Christ. So to sum this up, once you're in hell, you can't um, uh, you can't be saved or um, uh, or repent um, or, or 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 even talk to God because because once you're in hell, once you're in hell, you're you're just com completely separated from God. But in life, you alone can can save yourself from hell. But it is only by by Christ by Jesus that 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 we are saved. And we're saved. Um, we are saved by by grace through faith. We are saved by uh, by um, by believing in, in Jesus Christ and accepting Him as Lord and Savior, and and also repenting every day when when we uh, um, uh, fall short of the glory, whenever we, whenever we sin. And that is my answer to your question. So thanks so much for uh, watching this video, and um, I hope that that uh, this video um, helped you understand a bit more um, about about salvation and hell. And also, um, uh, if you guys have um, have have uh, any other questions, um, please do uh, drop them in, in the comments down below, and um, I'll do my best to answer them um, in in a uh, video. And thanks so much for watching, guys. And again, um, please do uh, leave a like and subscribe, and um, please share with with uh, family and friends. And please turn on those uh, notifications, as it really helps me out a lot. And as always, God loves you very much. I love you too. God bless, guys.